As the adverse effects of the coronavirus pandemic continue to bite, the government through the COVID-19 emergency fund has embarked on an exercise to distribute food to vulnerable families in an effort to cushion them and decelerate the effects of the pandemic. On Saturday, about 50 persons drawn from Mukuru Kwanjinga slums will line up at the Kenyatta Convention Center to receive welfare packages as the government kicked off the exercise. The president asked me to announce that he will soon launch the new shelter uh, upgrading and environment uh, upgrading program in Mukuru Kwanjinga. This is going to now touch on the livelihoods of the people in Mukuru Kwanjinga. It's a new ambitious program that uh, uh, the government has been looking for resources for and the, the president has been championing it himself and he will launch it himself shortly. Interior Cabinet Secretary Fred Matiangi will oversee the launch of the exercise that targets 250,000 vulnerable families. The stipend that we are giving to cushion fa vulnerable families that we are giving every week, now we are giving that stipend to about 250,000 households in low-income areas in Kenya, and we are targeting the urban poor in this process. And it's across the country, from Nyalenda to Bangladesh in Mombasa, Kiandusu, Mukuru, eh, Madare, eh, Kibra, and all these places. According to COVID-19 Emergency Fund Chair Jean Karuku, the food supplies worth 300 million shillings is intended to aid beneficiaries during these trying times. We coordinate and we've uh, dispatched over 300 million shillings worth of food. We also have some more in the stores to the tune of 100 tons. And today we also are distributing a lot, starting with Mokoro, Kwajenga. We are still appealing to Kenyans to give us food in kind, in cash, so we can support each other. Those attending the event held the initiative was timely, even as they called for transparency in the management of the funds. <laughs> Let's help Think about your neighbor. This is This is not the time for greed. This is the time just to help each other. Right now, it's important to know your neighbor. So if you're not part of the Nyumba Kumi, get involved, get there, because we follow administrative structures. And the kazi that we're giving for them, um, Tani, there are a lot of you need to obviously try. We, you know, it's a few numbers right now, but we want transparency and honesty. Uh, Wikitano zileopita, hatu ambao nalipu wa kila juma, shilingi miatano kwa siku, so mia, 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 mbili, mia elfu mbili na miatano kwa siku. Unapata wajapata umishara. Well, the government has had to look at different social economic ways to cushion vulnerable families using the Nyumba Kumi initiative to target the right families that need help. Reporting for Channel 1 News, I'm Sarafina Robi.